evening, good morning, good afternoon, everybody. Welcome back. This is a pre-recording of Mafia Roundtable with Dominic Sakawi. First off, uh, I want to just let everybody know, yesterday we had our first health segment, erectile dysfunction. Go to Guys, just go to themanshot.com or go to themanshot.com or go to mafiaroundtable.com. Go to the shopping cart where you shop. And you'll see the link will come up, click on it, and everything is discreet, or 100%. This, this shit's the bomb. It's good. It, it's, it works. So I'll go into that later on. But also go to egvodka.com, buy your vodka, 100% organic, excellent vodka. Today's topic, we're going to be talking about Tony Pizza, who was around Michael Nose in the Bronx, um... And actually worked for Vinny, Vinny Basciano, Vinny Gorgeous, who was the acting boss of the Bonanno crime family. Michael was his gopher. I, I mean, yeah, Michael was Vinny's gopher. <laughs> I'm being sarcastic, but um, they were partners in um, an Italian restaurant and I think a pizzeria. I'm not sure, but this Tony Pizza worked for them. And a lot of things went back and forth. So uh, Vinny didn't like it. And at the end of the day, he had uh, myself headhunting for this Tony Pizza. So uh, it's it's an interesting story. It shows just the piece of shit Michael knows is uh, what he did. That's usual. Second part of the story today is a guy, Fat Pat. Now, Fat Pat was around the Genovese crime family. He was a junkie. Uh, one of my father's friends that they were hanging out together. And this fat Pat, I got word, he smacked, put his hands on my father, smacked my father. Um, whether they were high, it was over drugs, or whatever the case may be. And then I don't know what happened after that, but I know he put his hands on my father. And when I heard this, I went to my father, and my father says, yeah, he did, but it's nothing, We, I took care of it. I said, no, 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 you didn't take care of it. <clears throat> so... That was number two, I was headhunting, where got the guys together. And Fat Pat was actually going to get his, have his hands chopped off and set on fire at the same time. So uh, we were out gunning for him, really. I was looking for him. So he's lucky I never found him. I don't know if my father tipped him off, but somebody tipped him off because he couldn't be found. And these are just stories from the Bronx. We'll go back to uh, mafia tales uh, going into things and how things work, how I conducted myself when I was with Vinny. And just people in the Bronx in general. Um, you had a cast of characters there, that's for sure. Now, another topic, everybody wants to talk about Genovese crime family. Yes, they are the elite crime family right now, today. But they got a lot of garbage amongst their ranks. And that's for damn sure. Um, you know, and who am I to call somebody garbage? Because I ratted. But at the end of the day... You know, these guys are just um, just the caliber, uh, just the way they conducted themselves, the way they acted. It just, it's mind-boggling. But I guess, you know, like they say, the um, you have a pond, the fish start dwindling away, so there's little to choose from. So I guess this is what they're stuck with. And some of the guys I'll be talking about in the near future, they didn't cooperate, stand-up guys for now. Uh, but they're looking at they skid bids four years, five years, ten years, nothing serious because nobody's doing any killings out there. They're letting uh, people run around and do what they want. So you know it's a different time, different era, and I'm I'm glad that there's no killings because people shouldn't be getting killed over street stuff. You know it's just you know things happen, but it's just the street ways but it's dwindling out of that life out of that stigma you know you mess with the mob you get killed and that doesn't just happen nowadays just because of the stiff sentences everybody cooperating they don't know who's who so it's a good thing we're also going to be i'll be back on with joe barone um we're going back and forth uh, right now there's a lot of things that uh Joe and I are collaborating to do, so that's interesting. Uh, on next Wednesday, on the 16th, we'll be at Bocelli's Italian Restaurant in Tampa uh, doing 
a live two-hour special Mafia Roundtable. We'll have other members of Organized Crimes. I've reached out to a bunch of people today. Everybody said, Dom, I'll be there. Damn yeah. Hell yeah. Yes, I'll be there. So we got a lot of people there from in the former life. Uh, High-ranking members, too. We have some captains, soldiers. So uh, I don't know if they're going to come on Mafia Roundtable, but they'll be there supporting us. And I'm sure they'll do a cameo, get on the show. So it'll be interesting. Stay tuned. We're also the lawyer setting up the 501C. All donations, 100%. I had to fill out the paperwork where uh, they asked about any funds go for attorneys, for this one, that one. Zero. Zero. All attorney's fees, any incidentals, pays, come out of my pocket. No. Uh, the funds are going to be 100% towards the kids, and I know I'm going to be coming out of my pocket for even more money with that, just because I like doing, I like giving back, and that's what we're going to do. We're going to go to church organizations, see who's really suffering, who needs it. Uh, I'm going to be hands-on with that, so the money's not going to get misappropriated. Funds aren't going for administrative costs. It's going right to the kids, to families, and that's what we want to do. Also, people, um, thank you for all the love and support. Love it. And then uh, we'll get back today with the live at 12 o'clock Eastern Standard Time. Sorry about yesterday as well because the shoot was supposed to be live. We had Wi-Fi issues. We just weren't getting strong signals. So we had to record it. And sorry about the delay. Um, you know, And I apologize for that. But uh, today we should be good to go. Um, so we have everything set up. The guys came earlier to set everything up. So again, um, wish everybody the best. Have a good evening, good morning, good afternoon. Much love. Stay tuned. 12 p.m. today, Mafia Roundtable Live. Peace out. <laughs>